Hello Year 11, it's Miss McDonald. I'm here today to talk to you about our A-level English Literature course here at Q3 Tipton. Um, if you're watching this video, the chances are that you're probably already interested in taking our course. Um, you'll be aware that obviously myself and Mr Dean Richards are the two teachers that predominantly teach the course and I'm here today to give you just a taste of some of the things that we might cover. So, I want you to ponder this onion, okay, the humble little onion. Right, if I chop this onion in half, which will probably go wrong, there we go. You can see that, obviously, it is nice and it is circular, it has got a brown skin. What on earth is she doing with an onion, I hear you asking yourself. Well, the eleven, the great and wonderful Carol Duffy wrote an amazing poem that is called Valentine, and in that poem, she starts off with, not a red rose or a satin heart, I give you an onion. It is a moon wrapped in a bread paper. It promises light, like the careful undressing of love. And when we look at the onion, you can see there is its brown paper. Inside is its light. Not really sure what it offers me the careful undressing of love, but perhaps if we delve a little bit deeper into it and we start to peel back some of the layers, you can start to see where she's going with it. But why on earth is she giving her valentine an onion? And that, are, that is an example of some of the questions that we begin to question and ask here at Cusary Tipton when we're doing A-level literature. Why an onion? Who's the onion for? Who is she in this poem? Is that onion a sign or symbol of something else? Does it exclude somebody? How do I react to this poem in a way that might be different to someone who is living on the other side of the world? Does this onion mean something vastly different to me if I came from somewhere in the Middle East, somewhere in Africa, if I came from North or South America, would I think that this onion was worth more than the rose or the satin heart? Personally, I'd take the satin heart over the onion any day. Okay, we are going to hopefully welcome you onto our course here at Q3 Tipton and invite you to study the concept of being human. The, old, the whole idea of studying literature is to study the human experience, to be able to experience a thousand and one lives by exploring a thousand and one pages. We offer you the opportunity to develop soft and transferable skills that you can use regardless of the career that you choose to take. So you might take our learning here of different plays like Othello and All My Sons and go off to walk the boards at um, a theatre in Birmingham, in London, in New York. You might choose to take your skills of critical thinking and reading from A-level literature here at Q3 Tipton and go to study and become a lawyer and next we might be seeing you um, in the Grand High Court down in London arguing for human rights. The whole idea is that English literature is a key that opens the door. It's about more than just books like Carol Ann Duffy's poem is about more than just this onion and we would very much like you to join us on that journey. We have some very dedicated students here already in the sixth form and we have some very dedicated teachers who are in the department to support you through your A-level studies. We believe that we can offer you both breadth of texts from reading Carol Ann Duffy's modern poetry to reading Shakespeare's Othello and we offer you the idea of being able to look at those from a whole other angle than the angle that you usually approach them from. We will look at Marxism, feminism, we will look at post-colonial views, we will look at ideas of reading things through the gaze of queer theory, we will look at all different types of texts from poetry to prose, fiction to non-fiction and we'll hand you over the onus of your study so that you'll be able to put your stamp on your interpretations. Please come and join us. We hope to see you in September.